What's up guys, so I decided to make this video because of my struggles yesterday getting this uh, Another pain mission day with a clear uh, mind. done to get this backpack really from the from the uh, Tadpole's quest, so I struggled to find the The Marluk hunter and I couldn't find any good guides or videos yeah. on YouTube to show now me exactly where it back is, to this area, all want seeing to that I haven't place. already discovered the location. So, yeah, I'm going to show you guys where I found one. It was right here in the ash heap in the southwest corner of the map, lower left. It's called Lake Reynolds. It's underneath Lewisburg Station and Lewisburg. The closest place I discovered was the burning mine, so I had to go from there. But yeah, I'm just going to show you guys. Hopefully uh, we get a spawn of a mile of hunter. And then I actually found them at a second location as well, after searching all day. Uh, which is... I'm, I'm going to show you guys in a second. But it's right at the top. Uh, at the Pioneer Scout Camp, funnily enough. They spawned in there right after I finished the quest. But yeah, as I came here at this gate, there was about like two or three of them. But like I said, uh, you have to maybe server up, or I guess they're only here in daytime. I think this is night. So, but you can take my word for it. They will, they will spawn here if you server up, and then. I can also, oh there, there, there's a my look, but that's not the hunter, we're looking for the hunter, they're very hard to find apparently, yeah this, oh here we go, here's one, oh shit, gotta watch out there, kind of uh, deep. not as if there's my Tesla rifle though, I hope this video helps you guys that struggled like me to find these guys. And, uh, I know you have to focus on a lot of these my looks for that tadpole twist. If you guys uh, like this, leave a like, subscribe. I will be uploading how to videos on various games like Apex as well but yeah um, the other location that I also mentioned let me just show you it's right here basically in the middle of the map at the top by near scout camp and right after I finished the quest they also spawned in there and then I'm also going to show you guys where to find the the Milo Queen, there's two locations. So if you travel to this camp um, and you go to the the Colonel Gutsy, right as I finished the mission and I spoke to him, like three of them stormed me, like literally stormed me. They were coming from the water side here but I don't see any of them now but yeah, I, I would recommend going to Lake Reynolds first if you're looking for the hunter. Yeah, because I don't see any of them right here now. And then, guys, the Milo Queens. Um, there's two locations that they definitely spawn. The one is here by the quarry in the south east corner of the map. It's called Quarry X3. There's always a Milo Queen spawning there. And I haven't actually managed to finish one off. I just took the photograph because they are extremely high leveled and hard to kill. So I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend trying to kill them unless you're really high level with powerful weapons. But anyway, there's also the Milo King over there. I know you need to photograph both of them. And then there's some soft shells and just uh, the rest of the spawns. I know there's also a daily quest where you need to photograph some of them. 
So yeah guys, um, I'm still pretty new to Fallout I guess, but I, I didn't find any video like this on the internet, so yeah, I decided to, to make this one. Uh, I don't know why it's taking so long to load now, but yeah, the other, the other location I think is Twin Lakes uh, for the Milo Queen, and you'll definitely find them at the quarry or at the Twin Lakes. But yeah guys, uh, if this doesn't load in soon, I'm just going to end the video right there. If you enjoyed it, like I said, leave a like, subscribe. I like to upload how-to and tutorial videos to help the community of whichever game, game I'm playing. And right now it's Fallout 76. So yeah, thanks guys.